financial literacy is something that you learn on your own. It's not something that is not often taught at schools or uh, academic facilities. Um, and if anything, Web3, if anything, since it's all about ownership, I think there's only going to be a lot around uh, academic learning around financial literacy. Um, I think people have to take in control of their own finances and not pass, just not to sit back and just get a paycheck, but actively do something to, to uh, accentuate their, 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 their year end salaries or their income in that sense. So with that said, um, I think technology will augment a lot of the, the, the passive income perhaps. And, we saw this in the form of DeFi in that sense with crypto markets, mm -hmm. uh, but with NFTs and uh, with DeFi as well as crypto, of course, yes, they're both all highly volatile in nature, but at the same time, if you do know how to work it and give, uh, educate yourself in the financial literacy of, uh, of all things crypto, uh, you'll learn the best practices. And this is kind of what we also want to mm -hmm. not only do and train and teach, but strong note is, if StrongNode was the first project that does the infrastructure, the second project is OGL. And OGL is uh, more of the, the visual layer, the presentation layer, where, where it actually is the metaverse. And uh, as OGL is the metaverses of metaverses, uh, it is actually, uh, it, it's another great way to earn passive income as well as uh, an alternative form of income. So if you mint and uh, if you craft something within our metaverse and make it at the NFT and sell it to another user, you can make money from that. Um, and as it's a, a free collaborative platform in that sense. Yeah.